And so they meet again. Boston Celtics, Brooklyn Nets. One year after meeting in the first round as the two and seven seeds, they do so again on Sunday, but this time with Boston being the higher seed. Here's how the teams stack up statistically. These teams are nearly identical offensively from a statistical standpoint. Boston has a slight edge in offensive rating and assist percentage and turnover percentage, while Brooklyn leads in field goal and three-point field goal percentage. Now this comes with two caveats. First is the fact that the Celtics have been the most explosive offense in the league since mid-January. They've been torching teams with an absurd offensive rating of nearly 120 since January 15th. The second caveat is that Brooklyn's numbers are skewed by absences from Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving this season. Durant missed nearly 30 games and Irving missed 53. So with them back and healthy and in the lineup, expect the Nets to be much stronger offensively. At the other end of the court, it's not even close. The Celtics are by far the superior. The Celtics boast the most effective defense in the league, and they were by far the most dominant defense over the final three plus months of the season. The Nets, well, let's just say they can't make the same claim. Boston also has the slight edge in rebound percentage. All in all, the Celtics hold the advantage in five of our seven categories. But remember, this might all be for nothing now that the Nets have their stars back in the lineup full time.